How we going guys? The Loot Gamer over here. And welcome to my next episode of Is It Worth It? Over here guys, I got the really beautiful ST100 premium headset stand with 7.1 surround sound. RGBs all up in there. If you guys love RGBs and all that kind of cool color stuff, I would definitely recommend uh, to get these bad boys because it goes to all different colors and it's a pretty premium headstand. But over here guys, of course, this is, spot, this is uh, from Corsa over here, ST100. The thing I love about this box is it's pretty much in detail, guys. It tells you everything that you get in this. So at the bottom over here, guys, it says um, this is a premium al aluminum construction, an iconic industrial design. Of course, there's a dynamic RGB lighting, which provides virtual unlimited color options. And of course, enable 7.1 surround sound on any 3.5 analog headset. So all that good juicy stuff over there. Also on the other side over here, guys, as we could tell, we get the ST100 RGBs and a bit of information about um, which kind of Corsair headphones actually work with it. And of course, the Corsair headphones over there, but I actually got myself uh, the Logitech G933 uh, ones instead, but I'll show you guys that in my next video. Also at the back over here, it's all information on these headstands over here. So dual USB 3.1 inputs, you get yourself 7.1 surround sound, uh, premium build quality, and RGB LED lighting. So, so further ado guys, let's open this up together. Let's just see exactly what we would expect from these uh, lovely stand over here. So where do I open, where, where do I start? All right, let's have a look over here. Uh, this is a kind of funny box because I'm used to always starting from the other side. Oh, there we go. Let's just open it from the side over here. And I'll open from the other side over here. But how has your year been, guys? 2018. I hope you'll be really excited from the new news from CES. Of course, it opens from the side over there. So what I'll do is I'll just take out the first thing. So of course, over here, we get ourselves some cables. This should be the cable that actually attaches to your uh, headstand, headset stand, rather. And of course, all we get inside here is our stand and nothing else guys just those two items over there so of course this is all we got over here so let me just open this up let me get rid of the foam let me put that aside let me have a look at this foam over here let me just open this up so we can check it out so a lot of plastic of course Oh, really nice feeling. A nice aluminum feel. So you know for a fact, it feels very premium. To be honest guys, I love this because it actually has the rubber grips at the bottom. So it'll actually avoid it slipping off the table, which is nice to see. Absolutely love that. Let's just check these out as well. Let me just turn on this flash so we can see uh, this video a little bit better guys. Let me turn up a, a bit of uh, exposure, beautiful. Let's check this out. So, of course, we get some warranty information, uh, which is pretty nice to see. Five years warranty, so really nice. Corsair, you gotta love that. Warranty guide, who wants to see about that? But of course, we get our quick start guide. So let's just open this up together so we can actually check it out. So, of course, quick start guide over here. So it's in English, of course, so we'll get all this information over here that we want to see. It's pretty easy to set up. So let me just set this up for you guys and I'll be right back. So here it is guys, the Corsair headset in its LED glory. It looks absolutely amazing. I love the design, a very sleek, but very sophisticated design, 100% brushed aluminum on this design. And it looks just absolutely simple, but very, very clean. On the front of this uh, design over here, guys, we get ourselves a USB 3.0 port. And also on the sides, yeah, a USB 3.0, which is nice to see. And of course, a 3mm head jack there, which is nice to see as well. So I'm loving the fact that around the whole side of this headstand, you get yourself the illumination. And of course, at the back over here, that, that connects to your PC, as you guys can tell, all that crazy cable management, which I, which I need to fix, which I'll show you guys at the end of this video. But this is a really nice, sleek, simple design. So in case you guys wanted a headstand that would actually, you know, match the color of your rig, you can definitely change the colors of this headstand. But right now, guys, what I, what I need to do is I need to actually download the software to actually make these colors change. But I'll show you guys that just in a second. 
So all done guys, all downloaded, a pretty easy download. Beware, it's about 208 megabytes. It will take quite some time depending on the internet you have. In Australia, unfortunately, it's not the best. But of course, we get all these options over here. In case you guys do have more Corsair products, you'll be able to link them all together and make all the colors sync, which is pretty awesome. But unfortunately, the only Corsair product I have um, is my, uh, my water cooler and just my headset stand. Um, so over here, of course, we get ourselves some, some lighting effects and EQ presets. So let's go on to our lighting effects over here. So as you guys can tell, it goes pretty much in detail, which is nice to see. We get ourselves a color pulse. So as you, as you can tell, I can change to any color I really want to. And it'll actually change in real time uh, on your headset stand. So I can change it to any one of these. I can even change uh, the positioning on how it actually looks like as well. So I could see how it will look like if I change different options. So of course I could do the top and even the side. So in case I wanted to change it maybe to I would say what to to green and the other color maybe to um to a really really nice uh pink or something. It would actually change colors between those two colors as you guys can see. As you can tell we get all these options here. I get spiral rainbow so I could change mine to a rainbow color which is really nice to see that. One of my personal favorites. But of course I've got one of my rigs. My rig is blue so rainbow wave as you guys can see even the Corsa logo itself actually lights up, which is pretty rad. Uh, and of course, you can, see, you can still see it on both angles, on top and even the bottom. Let's go to the next preset. Yeah, we get to, uh, to Visa. So as you can tell, it could just, you know, flash just like that. I can say random colors, or I can alternate between any other colors. So if I wanted blue, and if I wanted uh, green, it'll do a green, and then it'll do a blue, which is really nice to see. So next one we get is the color shift. As we can see, it does just different color shifting. So blue now, and then it will change maybe to a, uh, a darker blue. And then it will probably change to a really nice pink, which is nice to see. Next one is a, is a color pulse. So it's a bit like a heartbeat sort of thing, like a breathing effect. So in case you wanted to um, synchronize that with your um, rig on your LEDs, it's nice to see. We get ourselves uh, the color wave. It's like the color um, spiral rainbow, but a lot slower. We get the static color, so all you guys got to just do pick is this one color. So if I wanted blue, I could just pick blue. Next one, the lighting link. So this basically would actually match the colors depending on if you actually have more Corsair products. So you can just match them all together. Next, guys, is EQ presets. So depending on the kind of theme that I'm doing, so if I'm doing a clear chat on gaming or if it's a movie theater sort of vibe or theme, I could definitely change every one. So right now I have my Impure uh, Direct, which is basically the standard sort of uh, different EQ. But if I wanted to have maybe, let's say, a bass boost or something with a lot of bass, I could change it. Or FPS competition, if I wanted to hear more of my friends chat in the background, or movie theater, or even clear chat. I'm always able to pick between any one of the two. Another thing that I do like about this, guys, is the fact that, as you guys can see, it does support 7.1 surround sound. So right now, that's actually active. I can even change the volumes of my mic up and down. I can even change um, this to stereo or to 7.1 surround sound. And of course, you are able to save all these settings into um, your actual downloads, into your documents as well. Of course, there is support for this in case you guys do get a bit confused. And you're able to also create forums and join them. Twitter and of course Facebook, but I would say it's a very neat and very clean sort of um, you know software to actually use, guys. No issues whatsoever. But what do you guys think? Do you guys really believe it's easy to use or not really? So there it is, guys. The ST100 Corsair headset stand. Absolutely in love with this. It matches the color of my rig, as you guys can see in the background there, blue on blue. Uh, in my next video, I'll be showing you guys the nice Logitech uh, G933. Artist Spectrum headphones, the wireless ones that would actually match the color theme of this over here. And I'll show you guys how that actually looks like with the rest of my rig, as you guys can see. But I really appreciate the fact that you guys have watched this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Later.